No, it's not Santa and his sleigh, but a veteran in an 18-wheeler with thousands of wreaths. Inside were hundreds of boxes waiting to be unloaded for Wreaths Across America Day events. So the truck just arrived and the trucking company that came in, a, a husband and wife team, were here last year so it was good to see them again this year. And um, they delivered 240 boxes and it's always a big sigh of relief when we see the boxes come because now we know for sure on Reese Across America ceremony on this Saturday, we will be laying Reese. Each box contains nine wreaths, all handmade from live trees from Maine, that will be laid upon the graves of veterans on December 18th in honor of their service. Uh, these wreaths come from Maine and they're balsam uh, fir. The uh, wreath company that makes these, they have 14,000 acres and they tip the trees and then they um, assemble them and there's 10 boughs here and each one represents a trait of a veteran and also this very special tag that says today I placed a wreath on the grave of an American hero. A total of 5,700 wreaths in boxes were unloaded and will be stored until they are ready for use on Saturday. Deliveries were previously made in Iron County and now to a total of 13 cemeteries in Washington County cities. When I started it was just in Tonaquint and since then we've been a part with Valerie of course that's uh, got the sponsors to raise the money so we can do both cemeteries now. We've got over 2,000 veterans between both cemeteries that we will lay wreaths on Saturday for. And this Saturday at Tonaquint, we'll be laying about 910 wreaths here, and then a police escort to St. George Cemetery, where we'll be laying another 1,160. Besides honoring veterans, it's also educating our youth about the sacrifices they made by serving our country to keep us free. Families themselves bringing out their kids and grandkids and teaching, and that's what this whole thing about is, is to teach the kids what this means, what they've done for us and what they provide the freedom that we have. If you've never been to a Reese Across America ceremony and wreath laying event, this is your chance to be there and do it with us. Daughters of the American Revolution and all of our veteran organizations, they all support this here locally. And uh, so hundreds will be here. We hope you will be too. And as for the veteran and his 18-wheeler, it's down the road until next year. From Tonaquint Cemetery, Melissa Anderson, Community Education News.